What's up everyone? I hope everyone enjoyed last week and had a wonderful time with friends and family. I am forever grateful for an amazing family and friends and just for everyone that's really loved and supported me throughout my life. Whether we just met, we've never met, or we've been friends for ages, I am just so grateful for you. Today's video is going to be a little bit about the real benefits of homeownership. Maybe you own a home or maybe you don't quite yet own a home, but either way, I want to explain three benefits of owning a home. And number three is pretty eye-opening, so make sure you stick around to the end and see what number three is. So number one, real estate diversifies your income. It's obviously important to be properly diversified with your investments, and it's even more important to be diversified with your income. And this is because the largest financial risk for most of you is the loss of your primary source of income, which is typically a day job. So I wanna highlight how having multiple sources of income, such as those derived from real estate investments, can eventually lead you to relying less on that day job. Sound ideal? It can be. When done well, real estate investments may eventually open up your time and the financial freedom to explore other things like travel and aspirations that you might have for the future, particularly in the golden years of retirement. Number two, real estate produces near immediate results. You can achieve and feel the results almost immediately. Property improvements are visible and tangible. You can cash, spend, and invest those rent payments today or tomorrow, not 30 years in the future. So currently home prices are appreciating in all price ranges. And just last week, CoreLogic announced their 12 month home value projection at 5.6%, an increase from 4.5% noted earlier this summer. With that in mind, real estate today is definitely driving immediate results. And we all love immediate results. So number three, passive income can help you become financially independent sooner. So if we need 40 grand a year to live, you can alternatively invest in assets that generate an 8% cash on cash return. That's a very reasonable assumption. And it means you would only need to save a total of 500,000 instead of a million. Yet your investments would still meet your annual household living needs. So while returns, taxes, and inflation can, of course, affect your timeline, cash flowing real estate is a clear asset. You see, homeownership is a form of forced savings. Every time you pay your mortgage, you're contributing to your own net worth by increasing the equity in your home, bringing you one step closer to true financial independence, which is what we all want. So the bottom line here, if you want to increase your savings and overall net worth, real estate's the way to go. On the Walker team, we help a number of investors, both new and experienced, achieve and sustain financial freedom. So call or email me here today, and I look forward to hearing from you and seeing how we can get you on a path to financial freedom. I'll see you guys in my next video.